Sunny Wazini Mzansi, NNA Sports Show brings to you Her Majesty. What's your name? My name is Tolagele Jr. Tolagele Jr., hence TJ. Yes. So is that your nickname on the field, TJ? Yes, that's my nickname. Oh, okay. So TJ, what brings you here today? What brings me here today is to play soccer uh, against the biggest teams ever and to get an experience and win. Speaking of the biggest teams ever, which teams can you name teams that are big, as you said? We have Not Sundowns. that other teams are small, but... <laughs> <laughs> we have Sundowns, wow. Chiefs, um, UJ, Red University, yeah, I don't think. Oh, oh. And JVW. Oh, and JVW. Oh, oh, no, that sounds like hectic, hectic competition. Are you guys going to do it? Yeah, we will. We will. We will. And by the way, what's your team's name? Germany International Soccer Academy. Germany International Soccer Academy. Yes. Oh, wow. What an interesting name. Why Germany? Because... What's the history of your team? <laughs> I don't really know my history because the team is still new because okay. we just started right now. Oh. The team is still new, but yeah. And where are you guys based? In Benoni. Oh, so you came all the way from Benoni. Yeah. Wow. wow. So you cannot go empty-handed, go home empty-handed. You have to come back with it. So tell me, what are the challenges of playing soccer as a woman or these days are there no longer challenges or do you feel you're not treated the same like gentlemen? Or get fun, like how how different is it? For example, in this tournament, do you get the same treatment like the boys? No. Honestly? We don't. We don't because the boys have everything they need. They have the best coaches, the gazebos and everything. And you check the girls, they're just sitting there. That's not fair, actually. I totally agree with you. The reason I'm asking you is because I also noticed, not just in this yeah. tournament, every time you go to these tournaments, the treatment is never so much. I just thought it's me. Did you also hear what happened this week about Banyana Banyana, how they were treated? What's your thoughts on that? Do you think they did the right thing? Yes, they did the right thing and fought for themselves because why can't the boys get it and why can't the girls get it? So they need to be equal and get whatever the boys get. need to be equal. Everything must be. So... So in other words, kudos to Banyana Banyana of this year for paving the way for you guys in the near future. Yes. Okay, and then who's your favorite Banyana player? Banyana Banyana player, Rufilo Ejani. Ah, the captain. And then please wish them luck since they're going to the World Cup. Good luck, Rufilo. I hope you have the best game ever and win. Thank you. Oh, okay, well said. And then please say hi to moms at home. Hi, mom. Hi, dad. Hi, family. And hi to everyone watching. And tell them you're going to make them proud. I'm going to make you proud and win and score many goals as well. <laughs> CG, nice speaking to you. Thank you so much. Eh? So where do you want to play? One, did you want to play overseas? Do you want to play for Sundowns ladies? Because um, they're the biggest. Like, where do you see yourself playing one day? I want to play overseas. That's my goal, to go overseas, yeah. And specific team? Specific team. Um, Brazil. Brazil. Oh, okay. No, all the best moving forward. Good luck. Thank and good you. luck, ne? Shop shop. Cheers.